Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of my Let's Play of uh, Star Sector. So I was messing around with uh, Fitz and uh, and I made uh, I just made some changes and changed this to a uh, attack and lance instead of the uh, high intensity laser. The high intensity laser is uh, is good against armor, but um. And it's pretty efficient, but I I wanted something that would hit everything, or maybe something that hits shields harder, you know. So uh, I didn't want it to be uh, for armor, anti-armor specifically, and I wanted the range. So I decided to go with the uh, you know tachyon lance and then. Uh, and I also, you know, I kept the tactical lasers. I keep trying to figure out what I want with these. I didn't want to go with... Uh, I know I can... I can put like... Uh, Antimatter blasters on these, but the range is 400. So my ships are going to run up to them at 400. To be honest, um... My ships have a tendency to do it anyway, so maybe I should just go ahead and do that. My vi vision for these is that they is that it keeps its distance. Although, to be honest, it doesn't. They keep running up, uh, unfortunately. <laughs> so maybe, maybe these antimatter blasters will work better. Uh, I mean, I don't, I don't know why, but I think the the AI's behavior when it comes to these things is a uh, is a little bit nuts. So. Uh, One thing I could do, I, 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 I don't want it to, I want it to be able, I put in an unstable injector to uh, help with the speed. It's plus 15. Because I, I want to be able to get to the target and I want it to be able to get out of trouble but I feel like they're not able to get out of trouble and they s just have a tendency to run right up to the enemy. But 87's top speed is definitely a uh, pretty decent, right, I think. So I, I, I kind of regret NAV Relay because I can't seem to see the difference, you know. So this should four percent of your fleet by the ship's hull. Now it increases the top speed of your deployed ships, right? So, yeah, I I hardly noticed it, you know, even when I have all three. So, so I'm not sure this, this is doing much good. So, but anyways, the squall So what, what I, what, this, I think I'm going to change this back to a, uh, Locus, it seemed to work very well, and this thing will change back to Sabos. The only problem I have is, uh, unfortunately, it, it, the Sabos have, uh, limited ammo. I mean, even with expanded missile racks, so these will run out, but it's okay. That's fine. So that's what I think. I'm gonna change this, change out that, and uh, hopefully these guys. This this will be a better 
better ship. I also changed out the to long long range. Uh, does less damage, but uh, it, they'll um, they're longer range. So hopefully they'll start shooting at it long uh, and uh, destroy the missiles. So we'll, we'll, we'll whatever. Yeah, just confirm. Yeah, I don't control it, so <laughs> the AI can tactical laser. Yeah, the tactical laser. Okay, so uh, I have one ordnance points. Put it in vents. I also thought about putting like but like a uh, because this here this here is a medium I thought I could use a graviton beam but the problem with using a graviton beam is uh, it cannot track this cannot track to be honest this is better off being a uh, these are better off being um, antimatter blasters. So let's say I put antimatter blasters on here. This is one point only. How much do I have? I, I have eight points. <sighs> I mean, what can I put, put on here? This is a... Uh, I guess I can put this on here. Zero zero zero. Look at this. <laughs> no, I don't like this because this is not going to shoot all the time, right? Oh, it it's in charges anyway. So yeah, yeah. Let, we'll, we'll we'll go with this. It's all goofy. It's it's running up to the enemy anyway, so I might as well put it put an antimatter blaster here. And I don't have enough points for an antimatter blaster here. Yeah, we'll do that. It's all goofy. This is a goofy ship. <laughs> what a goofy ship with so many, so many weapons, different weapons. The, the AI controls it, so it's fine. Okay. So that that's that's uh, that's the changes, and then uh, I also uh, just used a uh, standard auto fit. I, th I thought these had two fighter wings but they changed it so it doesn't have any fighter wings so uh, and then this is just the uh, auto fit this one I just mo changed it I put tachyon lance here and some tactical laser and the graviton here uh, so uh, the rate the range of these is all like 1000 1,200, 1,000, 1,000, 1,000, this is 1,000. So, um, hopefully, uh, they can blast people, you know, at range. And these are fairly fast, 72. For cruisers, not the slowest, you know. And, and what, what it is, they have plasma burned also, so they can chase people down, although. So, you know, they're you know there shouldn't be any reason to really chase people down since you know to get up close and personal anyways uh, because this is of the range of these things this one is just standard uh, you know the there's a lot of uh, 
point defense. This one has no point defense, so I'll probably have to assign some ships to help them. Or, or uh, I should say, I hope these guys will help. <laughs> these guys will help. Uh, help with the uh, defend it, defend it, these guys. And uh, I try to put like uh, the uh, level seven, the, the alpha cores in here. But uh, if I put two, their readiness go down. So I can only use it on one of these ships, which is kind of sad. So, so I was thinking maybe you know instead of having, well, I guess I might as well use it on one of them since I do have the ability to use one. So. Uh, so I think I'm gonna put it on the standard, the one, this guy, and so their readiness is still a hundred. That's perfect. And I'm also not gonna take this. I I don't need two. I find I don't need two. You know I have enough for the most part. And if I have to dump some metal plates or whatever alloys, that's fine. You know, I don't need to be carrying all that. So inventory, so let's get rid of these. And uh, I decided uh, to not use these because dragging these around, their, their uh, D mods don't decrease, which is depressing. Um, yeah, so, so I prefer I'm I'm gonna probably mess with the standard one rather than these. You know the standard uh, the regular uh, Legion uh, fourteen. Uh, so fourteen battle group uh, variant, and uh, I I just realized I don't have one of these. So hopefully I grab, a, I can get an onslaught, a regular, not a regular onslaught, but a Legion 14 uh, onslaught. And uh, I was thinking of getting one of these, but then I have to jack up the, my crew, which means I have to pay more, and I don't want to pay more. So that's why I just went with that. Uh, and, and I guess I need a fuel ship now, now that I got rid of the, that, that other ship. Hmm. Cause it only goes to 177. Okay, so maybe, maybe, not one of the, this fuel ship uses four. I know it'll be use even less if I, this, this thing uses a uh, ten. Yeah, let's just let's just grab this. Okay, now we're we're good to go. The fuel ship. Yeah, it's two point one seven. Whereas this thing is five point four one. So we'll be using less supplies. Maybe I should just keep the other one. Yeah, I think I'll keep the other one. <laughs> keep the other one, and uh, I'm kind of curious. Uh, where's where? There it is. I'm kind of curious about uh, what if I changed my character to um, have don't have not have that. What happens to my all automated ships? Do they just disappear? I mean, I won't be able to use them for sure, but uh, so, anyways, let's 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 talk about uh, bounties. We colony threads. There's no colony threat right now. I check the colonies. They're 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 doing fine. No active com. Oh, come on. They. I don't know why it does that. 
no active calm of course there's active calm yeah I don't know why they always do that uh, but uh, I go there and it's and of course they have active calm um, anyways we, we're gonna do some bounties and uh, it looks like this one is it so we're gonna give this a try because uh, I don't know if if uh, if the new ships can handle I'm gonna take I'm gonna save scum <laughs> So uh, I'm going there. Let's look at gates. The uh, Arcasa gate is or Dura's gate is it? Okay, so I need to go to Dura's gate. Let's travel Dura's gate. Uh, bounties this guy is uh, the rumor to be hiding near a barren world in the system with the dwarf primary star system dwarf barren okay dwarf Baron. Okay, that's that's not it. Dwarf. Baron. That looks right. These are not dwarf. And okay, so here we go. Oh, I just I just now realized. Let me check. Yes, this guy can level up. Let's see what he can get. Combat Endurance. I always get that. Uh, I'm a big fan of uh, Fuel Modulation. Um, Let me check what's the status of my fleet. Okay, there it's in good shape. Alright, this is like a 370 rating fleet or something. Oh no no a uh, uh, bounty of 370 or 380,000. We're we're going in. So uh, all, I can actually deploy everything, but I don't want it because I don't want these guys to be like uh, losing combat endurance, combat uh, readiness. So I'm gonna do that. So let's wait. I guess there's hardly any difference. Why why wait? <laughs> yeah, I don't want them coming up anyways, I guess. Yes kill those uh, hounds and whatnot why are you backing off that always gets on my nerves when they just back off for no reason see be like this guy 
Okay, uh, maybe not like this guy. Okay, how did th that guy die? <laughs> yes, I like... Let's watch, let's watch this guy. That guy, that is so aggressive. He, he didn't even get the AI. Yeah, these guys are doing work. I'm pretty happy with them. The good thing about this is, yeah, these, uh, the beams will freaking kill them. These, these two are technically about the same, but, like, uh, in, uh, in cost when uh, in combat cost I think this is 20 to put out or is it 22 I forgot but uh, this these have a lot more utility outside of combat that's that's the that's the thing I like about them and and in combat I would say they're about I don't know I can't say which is better. This insane ship is so insane. We're still working through the armor. Now it's getting... Nav sensor jam. Whoa, about time. <laughs> but th these things are pretty strong. I forgot how much they were to deploy. These are supposed to be perfect. The hyper velocity, but they keep missing. That's kind of annoying. Yes, that's good.
Okay, let's see. Who escaped? Oh, he died again. It's okay. Let them go. Consider ship recovery for, for sure I'm recovering that. Yes, uh, too much fuel. Confirm. Hmm. Okay, and now. Is there a new. I guess I can do that one. With this. Duzak system. Okay, now I gotta find out where I can. Uh, I think Alpha Akron is it. Okay, quick save. Duzak is. I might as well go to. Corvus. And uh, lose my cargo, including that one core. And uh, 600 crew is all I need. Um, next, I'm going to do Zach. It says he's near Barren World. Have I been? I haven't even surveyed it. Oh, oh no, I have surveyed it. There's only one barren world. That is not the fleet I'm looking for, is it? It is. It's Dominator Atlas. Move in. Let me check what, uh, kind of fleet this is this is a uh, it's okay let's continue uh, these are 20s 20 pointers yeah it's okay all um, I use so little supplies that I don't I don't feel guilty about <laughs> taking them all. Yeah. Let's deploy.
yeah these these are even better than this because they can uh, they've got that burn whatever burn thing that allows them to move them yeah let's do it Well, you guys are going the wrong way. Why don't you go here? Oh, it's a comm relay. Why am I doing that? Well, since I'm already doing it, yeah, let's just let's just go. I don't need a comm relay. You can have all the comm relay you want. I'm waiting for that laser to go. Where's that purple laser? Come on, pack your lens. I guess you don't need it. No, I want the nav buoy. <laughs> Sensor jammer and nav buoy I want. the other one yeah in the face Disable ships. Is there another ship? Where is it hiding? Oh, it went to get the sensor jammer. Wow. Oh. What? Oh, the strike. Okay, let them go. Consider ship recovery. Oh, I didn't lose anything. Perfect. Mm, nope. Used to love those things, but last playthrough they were disappointing okay let's take a break here thank you for watching see you next time